Have a nice day. Bye. Thank you. All right. Good morning. How are we doing? Today we come on a food hunt here in KL. This area is called Bandar Baru, and we're here to try some nasi kerabu. You knew it. Our favourite food. So we're going to head into this building here, and fingers crossed this place is open. A miserable rainy day in KL. No better for a food hunt. I'm excited because I can already see loads of like stalls everywhere in this area. So. I'm so hungry. Right, this place looks really cool. This is the UTC food court area and there's loads of classic looking spots. You know, we got the old tables like the dinner hall style, school dinner hall. This Nasty the Max spot looks really good. There's roti chai, there's everything. Oh, I nearly slipped then. This is what we're after. Nasty Kerabu Mech. Mech corner. And they're open. It smells good. Let's have a look around here. Let's see what we've got. Okay, this is the spot. And yeah, everything looks fresh, it looks delicious. I'm so excited to eat this. Right, the food looks so good. So we've got all kinds here. We've got ayam per chick, Kalantani is special. We love this stuff. They've got ayam barempa, which looks so good, look at that. They've got fried catfish. They've got soloblada. Oh, I don't know what to get. And they also have te ice madu. We're gonna get some of these. This looks really good. So excited to eat. What do I get? Ini daging. Uh, daging bakar. Daging bakar. Uh -huh. Oh, saya nak nasi kerabu uh, special, but um, daging. Uh, daging. Daging. Uh, tidak chicken. tidak daging. ayam. Uh, da daging. daging. Okay. With solok lada. That looks well good. Sangat <laughs> sedap. Oh, terima kasih. That looks so good. Oh wow. That was delicious. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Excited. <laughs> can I also get Sainak? Uh, can we get Dua Te Ais Madu? Dua. Madu. Okay. Oh, okay. Excited. Can I make a say? We've been to Kalanta, so I'm going to see how it is. We, we will Kalanta. see. We will see, yeah. <laughs> is it as good as Kalanta? <laughs> can I make a say? There we go. Look at this. Wow. This food looks so good. This looks like the real deal. Look at this, nasi karabu. It looks like heaven. So, we've got our salted egg. We've got the pickled garlic. We've got our nice chili pile there. Look at that. There's budu, coconut fish, the blue rice, butterfly pea rice. I've got grilled beef. Dagging bakar. Look at that. And then the salak lada. What dreams are made of. Wow, so we need to give this all a mix in. You know how it is. There's a sink there to wash your hands. Proper good food court this. First, let's try the teas though, come on. Lip. Oh, good frothy tea. Te ice madu. Honey tea, madu, honey. Madu is honey in Malayu. And it does actually taste of honey. It's got a proper honey kick. That's fantastic, that is well good. You'll love that, Liz. Here's that honey. That's so good. Oh, isn't it? We haven't drank stuff like this in so long. It's good. <laughs> mm. And then oh, Leash yeah. got the same, but with the Iron Barempa, so yeah. show us that. So I got a breast piece, I think. It's a breast. Oh, that looks. That Malaysian fried chicken is the best. It looks Look so at that. good because it was sat there with all the leaves on, like this, looking so beautiful. <laughs> so I couldn't say no to it. <laughs> hey, I'll put the chapa down, let's try it. The boss ladies in here are really funny. They keep taking pictures and video and it's really funny. But they are really nice and friendly. All Malaysian people are really lovely, aren't they? Is it warm water? Yeah. Are you on the oh, okay. Indian spaghetti? Okay. Here we go. Caribou, <laughs> caribou. No, no, no. Okay, one, two, three. And mix it up. Caribou. Pandai. And bow, bow, bow. Sit up. Right, my first bite. Oh, sit down. <laughs> Delicious. Delicious. I will try in a minute. <laughs> it looks beautiful. Look how good it looks. <laughs> right, let's mix this up. Let's just move the meat to the side and whatnot. And then, oh, that is heavenly. Look how much. They're giving us so much chili to just mix through. That's going to be really good. So, yeah. Kerobu. Veg. Mix it all up. You've got to mix it properly or your taste is going to be all off. It's a There's no way around it, it's a messy job, it is messy. Get the chilli mixed through. 
probably going to cut back so you don't have to watch me sifting my fingers through this rice. It looks so good. Whoa, what do we do? Let's try some. Let's just try some of the rice, see what's going on. There we go, look at that. Oh yeah. It never gets old. This is one of the greatest dishes in the world. I don't care what you say. So good. Spicy. It's got that buddy, that fermented fish taste, like the coconut, the fish. It's so good. The rice is delicious. Oh, it's really good. You need to eat this dish. And then we got pickled garlic. To munch on as we go. Try some of the beef, grilled beef. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Then we got a salted egg, which isn't everyone's favourite, but let's try that. It just has a weird, like, never like a weird chalky texture, I can't explain. But it goes well with the food. The beef's beautiful. Look at that. It's so good. Honestly. Now it's time for the Holy Grail. One of my favourite things on this planet. The Solok Lada. The chilli stuff with the fish and coconut. Look at that. Let's go. Let's go. You need to get on these. They change your life, you know. So good. This food's heavy. A little bit sweet. It's not extremely sweet though, like it is in Kalantan. We have actually got quite a lot of spice in this, which I love. The chilies are super hot. It's good. I'm enjoying it. It's really good. Like you said, it's not as sweet. There is. It's definitely a lot spicier, which is really good. One of my favourite things is like just knowing on the garlic because it like refreshes your palate. So you have a really spicy bite, and you have like the sweet pickled garlic. So good. I've not actually tried the chicken yet. Get on that bloody no, iron barempa. I've been, I've been too busy with the rice. Oh, yeah. Look at that, you cut Malaysian fries, look how juicy it is. I don't know how, what, they're doing something. They've got some sort of secret tricks, the Malaysian people. Look at like. that. It's crazy how juicy oh, it's really, it's really oh, they're well done. They're really fragrant. Chicken's so good. Show us that chicken. Looks well. Look at the crisp on the skin. Like. Oh, but for me, it's just so impressive. It doesn't go dry at all. Like, it's still so juicy inside. So good. I'm really happy that we're eating this. Just realised we forgot some as well. We've fixed it though. We've got some of the carapot, the fish crackers to um, crumble over the top. Like so. For a bit of added crunch. Oh, I can't speak. I'm too happy. A bit of added crunch. So there we go, look at that. I'm going to stop filming now and devour this bloody meal. Let's just try Lisa's chicken. That was fantastic, spot on. That was so good. I've just spotted on this table, they also have loads of kuih of desserts, like Malay desserts. Bit of a different variety look. They all look quite good as well. And they have laksa, another Kelantanese dish. And now I think it's getting close to lunchtime, they brought out these curries. I don't know what this is. He just thrown loads of eggs into that. Oh, it looks delicious. Okay. Let's pay up. Which this? Oh, we've got a chicken feet curry as well. Everything else well, but what's this? Is that pineapple? This pineapple curry? Oh, that sounds well good. Pineapple curry. The nasi karabu, sangat sedap. Same, same kelantan, same, same. Very good. Same, same kelantan, sangat sedap, really good. Terima kasih. Terima kasih. They're bringing loads of new stuff out, so if you come, come at lunch, because you've got all this other choice. What is that? I have no idea what that looks so good. Looks well done. 
Let's try and pay up. They're getting busy. Yeah, it's been up a ring. Let's see how much it is. I don't know how much the tea were. The actual nasi kobe was 11. 11 ringgit, that isn't a bad price, I've got to say. For KL anyway, that seems like a decent price. For the size of the portion. Okay, okay. Yeah, 11, it's less than like two pounds, or just about two pounds. It's pretty good price, for KL. How much are the teas then? You know that te, te ice madu badafa ringgit, Satu? Uh, 140. Okay, very good, okay. Tell him I can say. Really good spot, check this out. Nasi Karabu Mex. Okay, Terebakase. Okay, goodbye. Lovely lady in there. That nice family, run it. Guys, I just have to show you the selection in here. The amount of selection is crazy. This is a big food court. And everywhere looks really good. Look at all these curries. Yes. <laughs> we are full. <laughs> Okay, Terebakase. Looks really good though, doesn't it? You spoil it for choice. Every single shop looks absolutely delicious. Another nasty the max spot. And yeah, it's filling up. Check it out where we got all the Malaysia flags. I like it in here. Oh, 150 for a nasty the max. This is what you want. That is a good sort of price. That's what you want. Karoti Chanai. This also looks really good. Hello, Apakaba. That looks like a good spot, doesn't it? Look at that. You've got a lot of, um, you've got a tough choice on your hands when you come in here. I swear every single store looks so good. This Iron Barempa looks heavenly. Look at that. Wow. That looks so good. Right, this is a little tea shop here. Selling tetere, but they've got kui. And this one looks really good. So we're gonna try it. You can see we've got various different Malaysian desserts. What's this one? They're very pretty, aren't they? Very nice looking. So this is palm sugar kui with coconut sprinkle on the top. We're gonna get one of them. What one we all the coconut on? Set best one. So you just get a bag and you just you just fill it up with your own desserts. Do you get one of these? These little pandan treats. There's some, something in them. There's some sort of filling in them. Oh. Then, no. then, should we get one of these? Yeah. They're like layer cakes, aren't they? Oh, oh, oh. It's, oh, it's all soft. Look at that. There we go. But that's very good. Oh, okay. okay. One ring at 80 for three of them kui. Not bad, is it? Okay, Terebakase. All right, let's try them. What do you call this um, in Malayu? Malayu? Apakaini? Not good. Not good, not good. Not good. Not good. Oh. You need sedak? Oh. Oh, what's that? Okay, okay, yeah, sedak. We're getting some dragon fruit. So we walk past this lady has some really good looking fruit. Like the colour of this dragon fruit. Then I can say, Incredible. Look at the colour of that. What a beautiful colour. Oh that my, is. look at that. What's she put on top? Salt or sugar or mix? I think it's a mix, yeah. yeah. We'll find out. What's she doing here? She's doing some sort of fruit cocktails, isn't she? Look. The lady just dropped a wall at least she had to chase her down because she was deaf and she was like hitting her on the back and it was an absolute ordeal she to try and her purse out of her bag, like right here. Yeah, it was funny though, I was like, I'm dead. She was just <laughs> running to the lift. <laughs> I don't know how old she was, but she had some bloody speed on her. So our nasty caribou spot is right there. And then next door, there is a South Indian spot that looks really good. It's got no name, which is drawing me in. It's not got a name at all. I love it. So we're gonna see. <laughs> what we can get in here. The lady running it looks like she knows what she's doing. And yeah, it looks really good. Ooh. So, they've got all kinds of different good looking stuff. I don't know much when it comes to proper Indian food. Obviously in the UK we don't eat proper Indian food. But here's where she's gonna cook the dorsas. They're very busy. Hello, can we get one dosa? Okay. Oh, so there we go. Some live action for you. 
Look at this. Hello, how are you? Hi, thank you, thank you. You're doing a video? Yes, yeah, making a YouTube video. Ah, yes. Okay. This looks really good. Also, there we go, look at that crispy dosa. That looks so good. Fresh off the flat top. And then another one goes straight on. She's really busy this late. Is this one for me? No. That's not mine. <laughs> just getting in everyone's way. Everyone's like, what? Who's this bloody foreigner just filming me? Just doing my daily work. A little bit of oil goes on the top. Oh, it looks really good. So what I'm going to do is just wait for them to bring it over. And just not get in everyone's way. All right, everyone, we've got our dosa. And this looks so good. Absolutely classic South Indian food. Look at that. Nice and crispy. And it's soft on the inside. This looks really good, and then we've also got three different curries or whatever. Is one of them a doll? I don't know. We'll investigate. This looks like a doll. And then, don't know what this is. And this is a curry with some of the ladies' fingers inside. Some of the okra. Some of these. So, this is just what I need a dosa right now. <laughs> <laughs> Can I actually try it? It feels like a pancake. That's what it feels like. I'm gonna go this one. This one looks like a hummus. This one looks fresh. I've got to get that yogurt. Let's try this bad boy. I'm just gonna show you how big it is. Because it's pretty flipping massive. So, got this bit we broke off. Look inside, look at the texture. Looks really nice, doesn't it? It's like airy. They are really, they're really thin, the batter is thin. It's good, isn't it? Fried pancake items on a grill. It's just good, isn't it? What? Wow. Fried pancake <laughs> items on a grill. It's just good, isn't it? Right. I'm going to keep this in the video, but we're going to try this now. I'm going to go for some of the ladies' fingers. Look at that. And that, my friends, is delicious. Really tasty curry. And the dose is great as well. Like I said, soft in the middle, a little crispy on the outside. Mm. Curry's really rich, a little bit salty. Let's try this yogurt one. Please try. Oh, I like that. It's really fresh. Mm. That's really good, that. That's really good. You've got to love that. Mm. It's quite heavy, though. It doesn't look like a lot of food, but. Putting the shutters down, it'll fill you up. And let's quickly try the last one, which is it a doll? I think it's a doll. I can see chickpeas. So there we go. Look at that. Oh, that's really good. That's delicious. Mm. This is a classic. You don't eat this often, but when you do, it's always really good. So I'm just having a mix on the curries. I don't know if you're supposed to do this, but. I'm just going to see what they taste like together, you know? I mean, you never know if you don't try. <laughs> Actually quite good. I look better. I mean, now I'm going to try these two together. Oh, you go there, you tried it before then. Really good. Wait, That's what? delicious. Get one of these ladies fingers. Go on. Oh, I've been rejected. No, I don't want to eat the finger alone. I feel like it needs something around it. Oh, look, it's in a sleeping bag. Ready to go camping. Oh, I miss my little boy. He's grown up too fast. Oh, just spotted something juicy in this doll. See that? That little young man there having a little swim. That's a chilli, that. Look at that. Tasty one and all. Smoke it. Mm. It's almost becoming a bit like a parody when you review it now. Oh, it rains too loud. No one can hear you. I said it's a bit loud. Can't hear you. Oh my god. There's a bloody dragon on the table. Oh. <laughs> I'm just joking with you. It's a dragon fruit. Woohoo! Right, we've got our dragon fruit here. 
Look at the colour of that. Not eating dragon fruit and I can't I can't even remember last time I ate this, but this looks really good. I can't remember what it tastes like. I remember it tasted of nothing but that's gotta taste of something. Look at the colour of that, it's like a flipping beetroot. There's a little bit of that salt sugar on or whatever. Salt. It's alright. Mild flavour. It's quite good actually. I mean it's definitely a fruit that looks better than it tastes. So look at that. She's beautiful, isn't she, to be fair? That's alright. It's very juicy. It's not bad at all. What do you think, Lee? Let's try. Can I say, this is my favourite colour. This kind of like pinky purple, like Cerise. Just in case anybody wants to buy this, anything that's this colour. How's it tasting, yeah? Uh, it's nice. See, it's nice. It kind of tastes like um, <clears throat> nothing, really. <laughs> no, it just tastes like sweet, but not really sweet. It's like a, for me, the texture is a bit like a watermelon. We've got to the bottom of the mystery. It actually does taste like nothing. It was the sugar and salt we were tasting that she put on the top. I mean, you taste a bit without that. It tastes like nothing. Juiciness. Like a cucumber. Great, let's try those kui we bought around the corner. I'm going to try the one that looks the least exciting first. It looks beautiful, but I feel like it's going to be a bit plain. You know what? I'm actually quite good, though. There's that coconut milk in there. What's that flavour? It's like the, the pink syrup in Thailand, like snake fruit syrup, I don't know. It's pretty though, and it actually, it actually has, I think, some flavour to that. Kui! <laughs> I think it's strawberry. Oh. I think it is, it tastes really good. Oh yeah, it is strawberry, but when you bite it, it like, sticks to every part of your teeth, doesn't it? It's like coconut, coconut milk, strawberry. Yeah. It's pretty good. It's actually quite nice. Now this one's the star of the show. This one actually looks really good. Look how wibbly wobbly it is. It's got a um, coconut thrown all over the top, palm sugar kui. Actually tastes pretty good. It's sweet. The coconut's nice. I was laughing because it looks a bit uh, suspicious, a bit weird. And all these thoughts came racing through my mind as I bit it. Last but not least, we've got the egg-shaped kui. I mean, this is pandan something. It looks quite good. What's in it? It's like in half. Oh, nothing. Most disappointing kui of 2023. Mm. That's really good. It's really juicy. I like that. That's nice. I've just discovered there was actually something inside this kui. I don't know what it was. Was it coconut milk? Was it condensed milk? Just found out the boss man's mother, who runs it, is actually from Kotobara, so she's from Kalanta. That's why we got all the good stuff. That's why we got the Iron Perch. And that's why it was so good. So check this place out. The people are really nice. Just good, humble, kind of Asian people. Now, before we go, I got to show you my one drive of this food court, and it's over here near the sinks. You come over to wash your hands, you think, flipping heck, it stinks of poo. And I've just looked in plant pots, they're full of cat poo. So yeah, just showing you that because it stinks. You have to wash your hands in the smelly corner. So one grab, everything else is amazing in here. Can't fault it. Proper top spot. Okay, Dere Makase, thank you so much. Sanga Sedap, really good. So good. Please follow me. That's my ID. Okay. Okay, and thank me. Okay, thank you, thank you. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Well good spot. Oh my goodness me, it's like we're back in Mexico. They look heavenly. Look at this. One last thing, we just got spoil speaking to the people at the Nasi Caribou spot and they said the chilies are actually from Kelantan to make the solo out of it, so proper stuff. Before we end video, we've ended up in a little market down here, it's really cool, the vendors are super friendly, having some proper good conversations, but look at this, it's a flipping fish madness. That giant fish dim sum it looks like, obviously it's not, but you get what I'm saying. Looks good that. Really good market this. Wherever we are, we've got squid. Wow. 
Little shrimpies and crabs. Hey, good market this. Oh no. Oh. He's standing in the way. Oh. <laughs> the cat was big man, big boss man in front of the door. You look right sorry, don't you? What's what has happened to you? Oh you? Yeah, what? What? What, what are you alright? What? What are you trying to say? Rude. What is that? Things that should have never been invented. The nasty kerugu sushi roll. Oh no. I'm not happy about that. Just got halfway down the street and realised we didn't pay for the dosa. Absolute disaster. So we've come back. We're honest, aren't we? Can't believe that. Hello. I forget, I forget to pay. <laughs> I did not pay for the dosa. But I but I ring it. Okay. We we walked to the. We said oh. <laughs> okay. Absolute <laughs> silly sausage. So the dosa was two ringgit sixty, I think you said or something, I can't remember. Okay, then okay, I can say, okay, okay goodbye. Okay, bye -bye. <laughs> All right. right, there we go, we'll leave the video there. If you want some good food and you are in KL, get yourself to the UTC Central. Food's looking well good. This whole area is full of delicious food. There's so many stalls knocking around, it looks proper good. Prices are great, food's good, people are really friendly. What more can you want? How were it, Lee? It was so good, and like you said, everybody in there was so nice. I'd definitely come back here and just yeah. have a chat, get some food again. Yeah, there's, nice there's loads of places we need to try, so yeah. Cheers for watching, see you later.